Hi, I'm Miss Shelley, and welcome to my science show. Today, we're going to play a game of red light, green light using a flashlight instead of our voices. Miss Shelley's Science Show. In our lesson on communicating with light and sound, we learned that humans have been using light to communicate for many years. For this activity, you're going to need some clear plastic, some scissors, some Sharpies or dry erase markers, and a flashlight. The first thing you're going to do is take your scissors and your clear plastic and cut some squares. Next, I'm going to take my dry erase markers and my Sharpies to color one square red, one square green, and one square yellow. So now I have a piece of plastic that is red, a piece of plastic that is green, and a piece of plastic that is yellow. Now in a normal game of red light, green light, green means go and red means stop, but I've added in the color yellow to mean slow. Now when you want to play the game, you'll have your friends line up in the back of a room, and instead of using your voice to say red light, green light, you're going to grab your flashlight and your colors to communicate what you want them to do. Red means stop, green means go, and yellow means to move slowly. If you want to have some more fun, you can use extra colors to signal additional movements. For example, purple could mean hop up and down on one foot. So why don't you try this game at home and communicate using just light? And I'll see you next time on another episode of Miss Shelley's Science Show.